Hi, my name's uh, Mo Jack Luhoku, and I recently just went back to VITS. I'm studying quantity surveying. Do you know what that is, ma'am? You don't fucking neither do I. I have no idea what quantity surveying is. It's my sixth year, doing a three-year degree. You know you've been at a place for too long when they're offering you medical aid. That's when you've <laughs> got to get out. But I say to my friends, it could be worse. It could be worse. I, uh, I could have studied at UJ. <laughs> uh, the only varsity in South Africa designed for repeat students. No, no, think about it. Why else would they have a residence called Amperda? It's in, it's in the name, this thing. It's in the name. <laughs> Before I was at Wits, I was at Northcliff High School, which was a bit weird because my Zulu teacher was Miss Anthill. <laughs> and Miss Anthill would stand in front of the class and she'd go, Sani Bonani, by children. <laughs> We're like, by children. Then our teacher learned Zulu from Takal and he says to me, what the fuck is going on? But then we got a proper Zulu teacher, a proper Zulu teacher. She spoke Zulu A, the kind of Zulu you have to herd cattle before you can learn. <laughs> you can't just watch Isi Tingo and understand it. Ms. Tola was a great Zulu teacher, but she would undo all of her hard work by trying to teach us things in English. Because she'd go, flying in the sky is a bird. Okay. When you go to sleep at night, you sleep in a bird. <laughs> when a child is not behaving well, they're up in? We're like, man, we're saying the same thing. Just differently. <laughs> but it wasn't a fault, guys. It wasn't a fault. Ms. Twala was a victim. She was a victim of Bantu education. And the thing with Bantu education, no matter how many degrees or diplomas you get, it always just jumps out in a regular English sentence. Like, I'm still here, don't fuck around. Because <laughs> you'll be at a classy restaurant, you'll be at a classy restaurant, and you'll be like, hey, can I have a bottle of Moe and Shonda? Can I have some soup without the croutons? But please, just leave out the onion. And voila! What is an onion? Is that a fruit or a veg? No, no, just leave out the onion and put in a bowl. We're like, oh, Papa. A bowl is the movement over here. It's got nothing to do with a salad. <laughs>